Hello, everyone. Hey, hey, what's up, what's up? At the Salty Rant time. And uh, I promised myself I wouldn't do a Salty Rant if I was in a really bad mood. Uh, so I decided to take myself out of a bad mood and um, win a match, at least. Uh, throw myself a bone in here. Which is great because, uh, you know, winning actually inspires me to keep going. Losing, losing a lot. Uh, sometimes is discouraging. So here we are with uh, TBR Inferno. This was a really close match. Um, as you can see, I'm just I'm falling for his pokes like mad. Um, trying to mix them up, not being too predictable. Yeah, that was nice. There, but there was a part in here. Yeah, I've kind of learned how to uh, avoid uh, guys' Izuna, Izuna drops. I would, uh, usually I would just like jump forward and try to beat it, or try to take priority over it with whatever attack I was using, but most of the time he beat me out, so I learned to just kind of, you know, jump back, or do that dash under. And for some reason, I'm not, I don't know why I'm not putting pressure on him uh, now. I'm just kind of, I'm kind of being laissez-faire about it. And I could have, right here, I could have applied more pressure and I could have chipped him to death. But I didn't, I didn't. Uh, I don't know why. Maybe I was challenging myself. Maybe I was just like, uh, ah, this guy's not going to beat me. I kind of had a really laxed attitude about it. And that was a nice option select he did right there. Um. I'm pretty sure that was an option select because I tried doing my EX pinwheel. Uh, it, it was a safe jump that he did. Uh, but I don't know if uh, my pinwheel would have went under it. Alright. If you notice in my uh, later videos, I try not to spam my EX pinwheel as much as I used to. Which is great. Uh, I only do when it's necessary. I have him in the corner here safe jump. Boom. Mistake because I use that hard punch, that crouching hard punch, and it, sometimes it doesn't connect at all. It pushes me too back to finish, too far back to finish the combo and it leaves me vulnerable, so I have to stop doing that. That crouching medium punch is, or hard punch is not my friend. And, God, Izuna drop on my ass again. And I had him on the ropes in the middle of the match. But there was just too much shit I whiffed. <sighs> Unfortunately. And uh, it's just Brandon. I've gotten into a tussle with this person's guile uh, several times now. He's beat me every single time, and I've been so goddamn annoyed about it. I was so angry. So let's watch how I fuck up here. Okay. Good so far. Probably could have EX as uh, that second hit. But. He knows he knows how to close in with his uh, his sonic booms, and I noticed one thing I'm not doing, which would probably come in really handy as to confuse the shit out of him. I have not been doing my uh, oh broke that combo, or start of it. I haven't been doing my counters, uh, my constitutions, I think that's what they're called, my constitutions. And it's been really, uh, really messing me up. I think I just kind of, when I get into the zone of like just trying to survive and trying to just get a hit on someone, I go into this... Like, in my head, my my move set gets cut in half. Like, the other move set that I have when I'm calm and collected, you know, I, I can easily use. See, I could have done a counter right there, but I didn't. Could have dashed in. And he was close enough for me to go behind him. That's to confuse him. Oh, he has a really good anti-air for that. You, you also notice I'm not jumping in. Um, I think his crouching hard punch even clips, even clips my, uh, my little my little jumping uh, light kick cross up. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. 
I think he just skunked me two rounds. Ugh, there again. And he's just spamming the shit out of his throws. He's got me scared. He's got he's got me scared. Like I feel like I can't go into the guy. I can't go into him. I don't I don't know uh what uh what good option selects I would have. I don't I didn't know see and I didn't use my counter either. I was too scared. I was being a coward. But uh this is the same guy again. And I think his main character is Ryu, but uh strangely I was more relaxed in this fight, I guess, because I, I know what Ryu's capable of. Um, I know how he closes in, I know how he how he zones. So, and just like I said, it's, it's, it's uh, Brandon's, it's just Brandon's pain. So, but I still wasn't, I wasn't that worried. But man, some people, some fighters just love their fucking throws. God damn it. Another throw. See, I felt that. I felt that coming on. The other times I'm trying to uh, <laughs> move my finger up to the right so I can stand block and then throw again. Yeah. All right. Are you going to throw me again? Yeah, he's coming up to throw me. This guy thinks he has an open invitation to throw me. He's just walk See, he's being he hubris on this guy now. Nope. Could have done an overhead, but I didn't. Uh, I actually don't remember if I... Yeah. Because he was expecting me to dive kick after he Hadoukened. I got into his head that much. He thought I was going to just jump and dive kick, and he was going to uh, he was gonna use his Shin Shuriken on me. But uh, that counter came in handy. That's what I... I should have used more of those um, just to kind of confuse Guile in the last round. Or the last match I had, but I didn't. Like I said, I was scared. My move set got depleted in half. I had half my chakra. Yes, that was a Naruto reference. More dive kicks, letting him know that he just can't, you know, run up on me and throw me. There he is. More throws. More throws. I hope I skunked this guy. And see, I did my Feng Shui right there, because sometimes uh, the delay kind of mixed people up. I don't know if that's considered cheating, because they already have their hand placed on a certain part of the directional pad when I jump in. And I think as soon as I did that move, he kind of paused. He didn't know what to do. Like his fingers got fucked up again. Um, so I knew after that I would just kind of take control of the situation. So I felt better after that. Um, if you guys know anything about how, I mean, besides using my EX counter on Guile to kind of just draw myself into him so I can cross him up, uh, please let me know. His anti-air um, crouching hard punch even gets me from when I'm in back of him, so that's not an option. Um, the best thing I can probably do is maybe do a, like a delayed, uh, delayed dive, ki dive kick so he whiffs the, the hard punch. But um, if you guys have any other suggestions, that would be awesome. Let me know. And follow me on Twitter, uh, Phoenix O Knight at Twitter, uh, for updates that I never ever update. And subscribe to me on YouTube so you can see more of this, uh, more of my salty rants. Thank you for gorgeous.